Hello fellow 3D enthusiast, my name is Ian, and today I wanted to share with you a quick texturing hack that'll make texturing a whole bunch of objects lightning fast. So, say we've got this really complex object here, and we don't feel like UV unwrapping it, and we want to apply this texture to it. As you can see, I've got my shader editor down here, and I've got the texture right in here, and maybe I want to drop this into the color. If we look in rendered view, we can see that's not applied right now, and that's just because this object has no mapping, there's no UVs, and Blender doesn't know how we want the texture to go onto it. So, a really quick way to map this, without too much hassle, if you have Node Wrangler enabled, with the texture node selected, you can just go Control T, and that will add in a mapping node and a texture coordinate node. And by default, it is always set to UV, but we're going to set it to generated real quick, and then we are also going to set the texture coordinates to be from flat to box. And this just projects the texture from all sides of the model. And maybe there are some points of this that don't look too good. It's all pretty angular, so it doesn't look too bad. But there's a seam here that we can see, and that's pretty nasty. So if we turn up the blending value, you can see the texture blends from the front projected to the top projected. And that looks really nice. So maybe you could unwrap this pretty quickly, maybe you could do it that fast, but the real value of this technique comes when you have a whole bunch of complex models, and you don't want to go in and UV unwrap all of them. So what you can do with this texture here is we can just select all of the other models, and maybe not all of them, maybe you just want some specific ones, but if we select this object last, and then go Control L and Materials, everything else has that material, and they're all box projected, and it's really quick. And yeah, that's the technique. I hope this saved you some time. Most of the time here, I'm teaching visual effects on this channel. And if you're interested in learning some visual effects tricks, there's a link in the description that goes to a completely free video that I've created for you. And in that free video, I go over five tips that'll help you to seamlessly blend your 3D creations into real life footage. So yeah, grab that if you're interested, and I hope you have an excellent day, and cheers!